here's a couple of things that I did, and, and here's my experience with it. When I found out that I had coronavirus, I got a positive diagnosis, I did some deep breathing practices. Now, Qigong is full of deep breathing practices. It helps to strengthen the lungs and the respiratory system, as well as keep your energy levels up. I did practices that lowered stress because stress compromises your immune system. When we're all stressed out, things move and progress in your system faster and deeper, and it's harder to get rid of them. For me, my experience was mild symptoms. I lost my taste and smell, and that was the most symptomatic that I got. I had a slight fever and body aches one or two days in the evenings for like two hours. And when I started to feel that come on, I did a practice called the healing sounds. And basically the healing sounds are said to expel pathogenic chi. Pathogenic chi, evil chi as it was known in the olden days. It's the chi that doesn't make you feel so good. So you have your own personal energy and then there's a pathogen that comes in, has its own chi and invades your body. So we expel that pathogenic chi by making certain sounds very specifically to get rid of it, to clear and cleanse. They were called purging. So I did purging exercises in the evening, deep breathing and flows during the day and in the morning. Man, that seemed to work so well. I took some supplements. Supplements can be very helpful. There's a lot out there about what supplements to take. I did some Chinese herbs, but what really helped me the most when I felt some symptoms come on, I had a practice that I could lean into. Let me show you just a couple of exercises that really helped me when I had the coronavirus. One, this is called heart to the sky. And you can do it sitting down, but I like to do it standing up. You stand up, you put your hands by your heart, and you inhale and open the chest. And see how this stretches the intercostal muscles, the muscles between the ribs? I looked up. And exhale, palms touch, sink the chest back. Now this mobilizes the rib cage and brings good, healthy energy into your lungs and respiratory system. If we can clear the pathogenic chi at the surface, at the sinuses and the respiratory system, it doesn't invade the body deeper and cause more problems. So we're going to do some deep breathing. Inhale. Now, when you exhale, try to exhale all the way out, sink the chest, make a little space between your shoulder blades. That's the back of the lungs and then expand into the front of the lungs. Slow, deep, long breathing. Inhale. Exhale, palms touch. Relax. Let me show you one of the healing sounds. This one specifically is for the lungs and you're gonna feel it vibrating in the lung areas. You're gonna go like this, take your hands up over your head like that. Palms face up. Your thumb is the lung meridian. So interestingly enough, we're working on the lungs, the organ and the lung meridian. Take a deep breath and you're gonna make the sound zzz, a Z sound. And you're gonna do it strongly and you're gonna expel old energy out. So hands up like this, you can take a deep breath. Now, when you do that, can you feel the chest vibrating? That vibration stirs the energy up and you are looking up and making a sound so that that energy gets expelled out. Let's do it one more time. Deep breath. Zzz, nice and strong, all the way out. Zzz. Now bring your hands down, hold them in front of the chest, and just visualize bright white lights in front of your lungs. Visualize bright white light in the lungs. Hands come down. And if you just notice how your body feels, sense that tingling, buzzing, life force energy circulating through you. This is your body learning how to heal itself. 
It's activating your healing power from the inside out. Relax. If you like exercises just like this, where you get to learn how to strengthen your immune system naturally, click the like button, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and ring that little bell so you get notified when we do more exercises and routines just like this. All right, thanks so much.